What's up guys, I'm about to start Mass, the Mass Effect 3 demo, it came out today, uh, it's probably up a few episodes at least by tomorrow, uh, I'll see I guess, uh, I haven't really figured out how to change the graphics settings in the demo, so it's probably just going to let you only do like, one uh, set until you get inside the game, uh, I'm not too sure, uh, anyways, it looks like uh, asteroids and shit are raining down on the, the earth here. See like all the like fire and stuff from the space too, so like Earth's getting bombarded by I guess reef birds or something. I didn't play a rival, so I'm a little, a little left in the dark too, but what's going on through. So uh yeah, let's get this underway. I'm just gonna do this at least somewhat quickly. Let's get right into it. I did do a little preview before the I started this, uh, just to get a little, little refresher on what I'm going to do. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, so, uh, I'm guessing right here, let's get what's extras. Oh, option. Okay, I was wondering how to change graphics, so I'm going to go ahead and change it. Uh, <coughs> Seven should be both be visible. Uh, I'm going to keep it. It's about where I want it. Seems like it has Mass Effect 2 graphics still. I'll see if it changes when I get in game. Uh, sound. Okay. Uh, Push to talk. Oh, well, they got integrated uh, voice chat and the multiplayer now. That's pretty neat. I'm probably not going to see that in PS3. <laughs> uh, probably Xbox chat, like, probably chat and shit. Uh, okay, I think that's good. Let's connect. Okay, um, <coughs> I just w want to turn subtitles on. Uh, not seeing subtitles. Ah. Okay, uh, yeah, I always plan on saying this. <laughs> Let's make this demo a little more interesting to it, but. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Uh, let's get the start up now. I'm not gonna spend too much time here. Okay. Yeah, I browse through the just this area here for starting, and it looks like a. Uh, this is pretty much cuts out the action setting right here. Cuts out all the. the Dialogue and shit. So if you don't like that, you just do action. Just mostly play the game like Gears of War. Role playing is traditional. Uh, guess story uh, lets you like uh, just follow the story. You don't have to go through like the missions or anything. That's what I'm guessing. I'm, I just go stick to role playing. Story and the actions. Get both. Uh, of the games, pretty much. Uh, okay. Uh, TF Factor. My uh, online name. Uh, na this name I've been using since high school. Yeah. Uh, Brad's our online name. I don't really believe in numbers or anything. Just well, like going by. I also like putting Kevin in front of everything. But, yep. Default. Like I like the default check. More with the default uh, female shepherd looks like. Probably like Ashler's. <laughs> uh, yeah, soldier. If I ever do another playthrough, I'll probably try a few of the other classes. So. Not sure uh, which one they've Probably one, one with biotic powers. 
Anyway. Uh, let's see. Physiology. Uh... Where's the space? Uh, I'm just gonna say Earth Brand. Born. Yeah. What's this? Uh... Ruthless. My bad, Ruthless in the first game, I forget. Uh, I mean, I always play Renegade, but I don't really want to have that as my background. I just want to be naturally Renegade. <laughs> A natural asshole, not someone that just like, grew up that way, so I'm just going to be Souls of Atlas. Uh, also, my first playthrough of Mass Effect 1, uh, I never did that on YouTube, it's like way before I got into video recording, so, Yellow Ashley died my first playthrough, she's like a bitch, so, I mean, I couldn't have that, so I just saved Arcadian at the end of it, <laughs> so, yes, yeah, uh, be who I choose, uh, You know, another playthrough, if I ever actually go through all three games again, I might leave, uh, let Asher live and let Caden die. <laughs> okay. Good enough, let's get this underway. I hope this game, uh, isn't like, uh, the second game. Maybe they went back to what made the first game good with the combat. You know, RPG health and stuff like that. Second game, I guess, uh, felt a little too much like a shooter, at least for the combat. Let's check this out. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost oh, contact with two of our deep space outposts. <coughs> There's something massive on long range scanners. Oh man, they're fucking fucked by Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life yeah. on it. Yeah, the council was like all arrogant the first game too. They said, "Oh, there's no reapers." Not long. I sent and then, they, then they all just showed, just one reaper wiped out a whole fleet, pretty much. God help us all. Then at the end, they showed showed them get like uh, faded. Just read. I'm not gonna read that loud. This. Maybe you look at this for the story. Just. Read your book. I already tell myself. Yep. Blah blah blah. It's... What's this? Is that that crappy uh, Mass Effect Two shit? No. <laughs> Paid like seven dollars for a DLC. It was like a crappy version of Wave Racers. That's awesome. They're back on Earth. It's nice to have some planet scenery. Not just flying the damn ship doing mission. Commander, you're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not I'm supposed Renegade. to salute you either. We gotta go. Yeah, the defense committee wants service. to see you. Sounds important. So I'm What's going on? not sure if he's back Couldn't at say. The... Just told me they needed you. Now. Like the lines are nice. From here. Anderson? Yeah, Admiral, like that guy's you look good, uh, living my place. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. Oh shit. Yeah. The Reavers? We don't know, not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. Uh, yeah. I look, it's, uh, never mind, I thought the Red meant Renegade or Perry. So I'm, I'm assuming the bottom one's uh, Renegade choices. It's the Reapers, and we're not ready for them. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the defense yeah. committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the committee <laughs> is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've Yeah, I won't say fuck you to the council. <laughs> We've all reviewed your report, seen the data you've collected. 
but it's all just theory to us. You've been there in the trenches, mm -hmm. fighting them. You know what they did. Is that why they grounded me? Took away my ship? You know that's not true. The shit you've done, any other soldier would have been tried, court martial and discharged. Just you. Awesome. It's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. That and your good word? Yeah, I trust you, Shadow. That guy so sort of sounds familiar. I'm just a soldier. He's he's from. From. No politician. I don't need you to be honest. Uh... I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. I forgot his name, actually. The, the pilot of my ship is uh, like Seth Green. Too, Admiral. That guy sort of sounds familiar, too. The Allstate. I got, yeah, I remember now it's the Allstate. Good luck in there, Shepard. In the unit, too. Shepard. Uh, Ashley? Lieutenant Commander? Uh, I'd like to let that bitch die. It's I can never tell with them. I'm just waiting for orders now. Admiral. Come on. Yeah, I guess I, guess I messed up there. Got the damn bitch uh, back. <laughs> Do you know the commander? I used to. I thought Caden was the one where he, like, let him live. This, uh, I guess, uh, should have read the description. But yeah, he asked. Fuck. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. That's the, that's the council. What's the situation? We were hoping that you would see tell the us. Look in their faces when they say the all these right. Even in the second game, they're. Oh, All assholes. <laughs> we lost contact with everything beyond the soul relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. Uh, yeah, the Reapers are here. Oh no. Then, what are we gonna do now? How do we stop them? Oh, stop fuck them up. This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. War, bitch. More powerful, Great ninja war. more intelligent. They don't fear us. So and they'll never take pity on us. Give your great uh, motivation speech, Chef. There must be some way. Survive at all costs. They want to be uh, all nice. We stand together. And uh, we'll fuck each other back. Each of us has to be willing to die to save humanity. Yeah. Anything less? And they've already won. You die or die that's the best. That's it. That's our plan? Mm -hmm. Admiral, we've up, lost yeah. contact <laughs> with Luna Base. Oh, they, Boom. They're coming. They couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. They show a lot of those robots loose on the Lunar Base. Fuck those Reapers up. They just give them a little slow down. Signal lost, of course. So they were instant replay. Is that a Reaper? Uh, I don't know. I can't tell. But looks like a bunch of uh, Skyline shit. I 